Your Excellency, to see very many leaders coming together um, from government, from the private sector, from our development partners, from research and academia, gathered here today to launch this absolutely vital plan. I'm very pleased, Your Excellency, that you will lead the inauguration of the new road safety strategy. On my part, it's a pleasure to host all of you um, in Nairobi and to welcome you most warmly. I think we all have an idea of the magnitude of the problem um, that we are facing. We've lost too many people um, on our roads. And this isn't only the only matter of concern. There's also too much pollution um, on the road, particulate matter, especially in the city. Children are coughing, you know, going to school. And due to these respiratory illnesses, um, it actually accounts for 20% of the disease load, Your Excellency, as per the 2023 economic survey done by the Ministry of Planning. I will say again, as I've said before, Your Excellency, behind these numbers are called tra real tragedies, Your Excellency. Everyone who's passed on um, in 2023 or 2022 was somebody's child. They were loved. They had something to look forward to doing in life. Those dreams are gone. Those families are left with memories. Those families are left with grief. Those families are left with bills to pay. Many of those that we've lost, Your Excellency, also have been young people. If I remember right, a clear majority were below the age of 40. They had productive years ahead of them, and we've lost that as a country. We leaders have an opportunity to change all of this. Our generation of leaders, Your Excellency, can be one that finally solves this traffic transport and pollution um, problem. Your Excellency, I'm, I'm very pleased by the work that uh, the Minister, our Cabinet Secretary, Kipchumba Murkomen, has been doing together with the NTSA, um, George Njau and, uh, and the Board, Manoj. They've been doing a good job. We need to radically look at our laws, sir. The Traffic Act that we have was first passed in on the 11th of November, 1953, Your Excellency, and commencement date was 1st January, 1954. It, is, it still has some relics of the you know, history of this city. I'll give you an example. There are only three people who can stop a car, according to the Traffic Act, Section 52. Police officer, an ambulance, and a Maasai herding cattle. It still provides for them, if you look at Section 52. So I know people have been complaining about the herders. Nairobi was owned by Maasai, so they actually have authority, legally, to be herding their cows and to stop uh, traffic. I don't know if we need to amend that because of the heritage of, of the city, but it tells us that there's something that needs to be looked at in our regulations. I think it must be 52-4 um, uh, of, that, of, that, uh, of that act. Your Excellency, all the rules that are required are known to all of us. Section 60 of the same law prohibits more than one billion ta on a border border. It's clear. The law is there. The police know the law. We know the law. We see six people on a bike. Five people on a bicycle. Um, one of the positions I hold that I don't like, Your Excellency, I'm the patron of a group of widows, of border border riders. Widows. And it keeps piling up. They think traffic lights are a suggestion. They go anti-clockwise on a roundabout, Your Excellency. But as they do that, we watch them. The police watch them. And we wonder why these numbers are high. I don't think there's a need for much more, you know, than we already have within our, 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 our legal you know, uh, frameworks. The laws are clear. Let us just have the shared responsibility to do what is needed to be done. A few months ago, um, I think it was in February, I was meeting uh, the Matatu Karagasha in your team, the Matatu Corridor uh, representatives, uh, yes, Mudeu, um, as I always meet them, Your Excellency. And before that meeting, I called George and asked him to give me the statistics of uh, road accidents. He said, first, Nairobi is highest. But the cause is that in many of our Matatu Termini, there are wines and spirit shops, the, the drivers and touts as they wait, isn't it? Eh? Forward Zarko, my friend. As they wait, wanakunywa, and then they go and drive those vehicles. Your Excellency, I have closed 150 
of those uh, wines and spirits that are at Matatu Terminal, and we will not open them, Your Excellency. We can we can have them operate elsewhere, but I have closed them. If you go to the back streets of, of, of the CBD, um, if you go to Country Bus, you will not find them anymore. And so, Kiski Anduru, please, Your Excellency.